the existence of Pavarolo is noted for the first time in a 1047 diploma of Emperor Henry III pertaining to the estates of the Turin canons of San Salvatore. In 1164, Frederick Barbarossa bestowed it upon the Marquises of Monferrato, but its vicinity to the commune of Chieri was such that it guaranteed excellent relations with the leading commune, to the point that, in 1235, it recognized the village's inhabitants as its own citizens. Having passed together with Chieri to the Savoia Chialine in 1347, Pavarola was subject to occupation by the soldiers of Facino Cane on the payroll of the Marquises of Monferrato, and in 1400 the people of Chieri liberated it to arrive at a definitive peace treaty in 1411. Highlight of the village is the castle, originally built during the 14th century but successively modified, with a passage from the defensive architecture to a residential one. The first function is still visible in certain aspects, such as the elevated angular truncated turret and the bricked up windows with their gothic outline. Another significant element of the Pavarolo architecture is the gate tower. Of medieval origin, it had a complete makeover to become a clock tower in the 18th century. Near the tower lies the parish church of Santa Maria dell'Olmo. Built with three naves, it probably occupies the site of the more ancient church dedicated to San Secondo. Other religious buildings worthy of note are the 17th century San Defendente Chapel, that of San Grato, and the Chapel of San Sebastiano. 